Hello, hi everyone. Uh, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to check out the video by Rahul titled as Is your monthly mutual portfolio working? Our three big mistakes in mutual fund portfolio. Let's jump to the video. In this example, just because you did not review your mutual fund portfolio, a reduction in 2% in your returns from 14% to 12%, you are going to lose at least 18 lakh rupees. That is 18% drop in your mutual fund portfolio returns. Hi friends, if you watch videos such as buy these 5 mutual funds and forget, then please stop watching those videos because you are going to lose lakhs of rupees if you just buy the mutual funds and forget about them. You must review your mutual fund portfolio periodically because it is necessary to make some changes even if you are a pure index investor. Also in this video I am going to ask you a question and the best answer is going to get one of my favorite book The Psychology of Money delivered to your doorstep absolutely free as a gift from me. A big shout out to the sponsors of this video deserve an AMFI registered mutual fund distributor that provides mutual fund portfolio review at zero cost through their wealth monitor app. Have a look at my screen and let us assume that every year you want to invest 1 lakh rupees whether you take SIP route or want to invest using lump sum route that does not really matter. What really matters is for you to have those mutual funds in your portfolio that can consistently beat the benchmark returns. That is the bare minimum investors like you and me must try to accomplish. Even if right now I assume benchmark returns then in the next 20 years your 1 lakh rupees of per year investment is likely to fetch you roughly 1 crore rupees assuming that the average return that you are going to have is 14%. Of course, the return on every year will vary depending on the benchmark returns. But for the simplicity, if we assume average returns of 14%, you're going to build 1 crore rupees of wealth after 20 years. Now, what are your chances to be able to beat the benchmark returns? Well, it could be 100% or it could be 0%. It really depends on the efforts you make on your mutual fund portfolio reviews that you do. And just so that you know, 67% investors fail to beat the benchmark index returns. Now, let us assume that you do not review your mutual fund portfolio periodically, then what is likely to happen is that some of your mutual funds are going to underperform. For an example here, if you see out of the 20 years, even if I assume that five years, your mutual fund portfolio is not giving you the benchmark return. So for example, here in 2025, instead of earning 15% return, your portfolio generates only 10%. Here in 2027, rather than 25%, your portfolio generates 20% returns and so on. What is likely to happen is that you are going to lose a lot of money. In this example, just because you did not review your mutual fund portfolio, a reduction in 2% in your returns from 14% to 12%, you are going to lose at least 18 lakh rupees. That is 18% drop in your mutual fund portfolio returns over the 20 years period. Now your natural question will be that Rahul, are there any mutual funds that consistently beat the benchmark index return? My answer is yes. For example, have a look at my screen and you will see that in the large and mid cap category, these three mutual funds have consistently on a period of three years, five years, seven years and 10 years horizon have beaten the benchmark index return. This is not a recommendation by any means, but I hope you get the point. So the big question is, how do we go about reviewing the performance of our mutual fund portfolio? There are basically two options in front of you. Option number one is for us to go to a registered financial advisor, pay their fees and get our mutual fund portfolio review done. Option number two is to use zero cost deserve wealth monitor app that has been built by experts that have managed the funds to the tune of 50,000 crore plus and have been in industry for more than 20 plus years. Deserve Distribution Services Private Limited is an AMFI registered mutual fund distributor offering mutual fund distribution services. Let me give you a quick demo. What you essentially do is download this app and provide your PAN number as well as your phone number that is linked to the PAN number. And what is going to happen is the app is going to automatically pull all your mutual fund portfolio details and it will start to analyze it. For example, what you see on my screen is a sample analysis. And if you go to the performance here, you will see that it is showing me that 7 out of 27 mutual funds right now have not been able to beat the benchmark returns in the past. 
so what it is showing me is that the underperformance is almost by 21.4 percent also it has analyzed and shown me that right now the missed gains are roughly 79,000 rupees it also tells you the seven funds that have not been able to beat the benchmark return so let us go ahead and have a look at this here and it is clearly showing you which are the mutual funds that has not been able to beat the benchmark returns this is an extremely simple app to use from a user interface navigation perspective you may wonder nothing in this world is free so are there any hidden charges so the use of this app is 100% free now the question time let me know in the comments which is your favorite mutual fund and why and I will pick up the best answer based on the reasoning why you saying a particular mutual fund is your favorite mutual fund and I will deliver the psychology of money book absolutely free at your doorstep the second key reason we must review our mutual fund portfolio periodically is because our risk profile changes constantly if you watched my mutual fund series buy four mutual funds every single month you will recollect that i explained three types of investors conservative investors balanced investors and aggressive investors now as you grow old your risk profile changes for example a simple framework that i used to explain to my students is that if you are in the age band of 20 to 30 you can be an aggressive investor while if you are in the age band of 30 to 40 you need to be a balanced investor while if you are in the age band of 40 to 50 or even more you must be a conservative investor but nowadays millennials and gen z's are proving to be extremely extremely different individuals for example i know somebody who is not even married and at the age of 35 they don't need to be a balanced investor they can happily be an aggressive investor at the same time i know a lady friend of mine who is 28 years of old and is already a mom to four children and cannot afford to be an aggressive investor when it comes to mutual fund investing my point is very simple your personal life events will dictate your risk profile and therefore you must review your mutual fund portfolio in light of your risk profile and deserve wealth monitor app helps you to review your mutual fund portfolio based on your risk profile let me quickly show it to you what you see on my screen is the risk exposure of this sample mutual fund portfolio and you will see that right now it is showing that the risk exposure right now is low volatility risk but if you go down you will see that out of the 27 mutual funds for this portfolio it is showing that one of the fund is is showing high volatility and what it is doing is it is recommending that you potentially should consider exiting that one mutual fund and reinvest this amount but let us go ahead and click on reinvest the amount and what you will see here is that it is now suggesting you whether you want to go conservative investor approach or whether you want to take balanced investor approach this is what I really like about this app where it is not blindly recommending you certain mutual funds what it is trying to do is telling you that if you want to go conservative here is your route if you want to go balanced then here is your route so this mutual fund app is going to analyze your mutual fund portfolios risk exposure which is extremely extremely important important the third very important aspect of mutual fund portfolio building is discipline let me prove it by data what you see on my screen is two investors investor a and investor b investor a invest 1 lakh rupees every single year so he is maintaining the discipline for the next 20 years and you will see that by the end of the 20 years he has invested roughly 20 lakh rupees on an average return of 14 percent he is going to have 1 crore rupees of wealth built in the 20 years time while investor B if you look at it you will see that he is not a very disciplined investor so for example in 24 and 25 he is not invested any money but all of a sudden in year 2027 he is put in 2 lakh rupees again in 28 29 he is not invested any money but again in 2032 he has invested roughly 3 lakh rupees again next 2 years no investment so there is no discipline here but in 2035 he has invested all of a sudden 6 lakh rupees and eventually he completes his 20 lakhs of investment over 20 years of period of time but very irregular investing style you will see that if I assume the same 14% average return then investor B is going to be worse off by roughly 10 lakh rupees investor A is going to have roughly 1 crore rupees of wealth after 20 years but investor B is only going to have 90 lakh rupees even though both of them have invested the same amount and same average returns so this is the power of being disciplined investor so bizarre wealth monitor app reviews your investment history and tells you whether you are a disciplined investor or not let me quickly show it to you as you can see on my screen the app is now showing for this sample analysis that we are doing that the investing discipline is inconsistent 
it is showing that your monthly investments are not consistent the number of sip shown here is only 9 and also the monthly amount is roughly 23000 rupees also if you look at it what it is su suggesting is that you must top up your sips on a yearly basis because it is very very important to maintain that investing discipline so i would highly encourage you to download this app you will find the link in the description box and try to analyze your mutual fund portfolio right away guys i am not saying that you must hop from one mutual fund to another mutual fund my point is extremely simple that you must nurture your mutual fund portfolio and at least try to beat the benchmark index return that is the simple message i want to give you through this video